assalamu alaikum in this class we are going to discuss about multiplicative inverse of a matrix here are some components uh, we are going to use in the in solving the questions we have to first uh, learn about the determinants singular matrix non singular matrix and uh, we will learn about how to find out the adjoint so let's start first we are going to find out how to uh, solve determinants we are going to learn that if uh, a is a 2 by 2 square matrix and the entries i have written uh, the elements as a b c d so the formula of to find out the determinant is simply we are going to write the determinant and it will be a determinant in the form of these b's bars and we will write a b c and d the final entry the formula will be a into d minus b and c so if we find find out any of the answer in an any real number form then it will be a singular matrix and if we don't find sorry non singular matrix and if we find an uh, the answer equals to 0 then it will be uh, known as a singular matrix okay so for find uh, in order to proceed in the multiplicative inverse matrix we have to find out the determinant in the form of non singular matrix that is not equals to 0 so this is the normal way to find out the determinant a b c d we have to find out the product of ad then subtracted uh the product of bc from the first product so let's continue here i have taken a matrix b which is of 2 uh, by 2 square matrix so we have to find out the determinant we are going to write it in such a way you know that this is a b c d so a d minus b c we have to find it out so a and d we will write 1 multiply by 3 Minus B C is one multiplied by minus two. Let's find out the answer is equals to zero or not equals to zero. If it is equals to zero, then we will stop working over here and will will not be uh, will not proceed the procedure of multiplicative inverse. But if the answer is not equals to zero, that means we uh, we are able to continue. So one three is a three minus minus plus one two is a two. It will be five. and which is not equals to 0 so it is a non singular matrix we are going to do the uh, following things so determinant is done we are going to find out the adjoint let's see how acha next step is singular or non singular matrix in order to find out the singular uh, whether the matrix is singular or non singular we are considering a equals to 1 to 0 and 0 this is the matrix and uh, according to the rule of ad minus bc we are going to write 1 multiplied by 2 minus 2 multiplied by 0 so 1 0 0 2 0 0 so it is equals to 0 so that is a singular matrix we are not going to proceed for checking for the next uh, level that is non singular matrix so we are taking 1 1 0 2 this is another matrix this was 1 and this is a 2 second matrix a equals to this so taking ad minus bc rule 2 multiplied by 1 minus 1 multiplied by 0 so 2 ones are 2 minus 1 0 0 it will be equals to not equals to 0 that is 2 okay so this is a non singular matrix and this one is a singular matrix the answer you obtained is equals to 0 this is why it is a singular and this is not equals to 0 that's why it is non singular matrix i hope that you have understood what are the singular and non singular matrix along with the determinant these are all the components of multiplicative inverse of a matrix determinant uh, and then finding out the singular non singular matrix which i have already uh, told you and then the last one is the adjoint these are the simple steps in by applying these we can find out this whole thing now next thing is a joint a joint of a mat square matrix let's suppose a equals to again a b c and d so it is obtained by interchanging the original 
entries and changing the sign of other entries diagonal entries kaun si hoti hain these are the diagonal entries we are changing the uh, interchanging the entries that is interchanging entries d and a theek hai just swap these theek hai na they will replace their places and uh, next what are the left over entries b and c they will change their signs theek hai so positive b will become negative b positive c will become negative c all right if i say that uh, uh, this one is my matrix for suppose 1 2 3 and 4 so if you are finding out their joint they will simply change into entries will replace i mean change their places 4 and 1 and 2 will become minus 2 3 will become minus 3 simple is that this is how you find out the adjoint of any matrix adjoint of a okay this is the uh, simple simplest method okay so all the components we have learned how to uh, solve them now we are going to uh, do the multiplicative inverse the main question by adjoint method let's suppose if we have m equals to 2 1 minus 1 and minus 3 okay so then we will find out first the determinant checking the singular and non singular uh, matrix then we will find the adjoint then we will proceed with the next thing theek okay? hai the formula for uh, inverse multiplicative inverse is simply m inverse denotes the multiplicative inverse of matrix m equals to adjoint of m upon determinant of m so in order to find out the multiplicative inverse of any matrix we have to find out first the adjoint of that matrix and the determinant of that max matrix so first of all we are finding out the determinant determinant of m so determinant of m will be this is 2 1 minus 1 minus 3 it it is not necessary to write it but i'm just showing you to make it simply for simply uh, five for you so it will be 2 ad this is ad minus bc 1 multiplied by minus 1 so it will be minus 2 is a 6 minus minus plus 1 one, 1 is a 1 so the answer will be minus of 5 which is not equals to 0 not equals to 0 then it means that we are going to uh proceed further so determinant of m is equals to minus of 5 all right next is adjoint for adjoint what we are going to do adjoint is equals to simply write interchange the places first of all minus 3 up to down positive becomes negative and negative become positive this is the adjoint now we have to write the adjoint of m upon determinant of m right so what we are going to do we are going to do this upon this okay so simply write minus 5 down or you can write it like this minus 1 upon 5 and the whole determinant minus the whole bracket or the matrix okay now this is being multiply over here so i'm going to introduce it in within the matrix how we will write minus 3 upon minus 5 minus 1 upon minus 5 1 upon minus 5 2 upon minus of 5 so here the answer will be Three upon five, one upon five, one my negative one upon five, and two by five with the sign of negativity. So this is the simplest method. We do the inverse in matrices uh, using the determinant, the adjoint, the uh, singular and uh, non-singular uh, ways of matrices. This is the way to find out the multiplicative inverse of any of the matrix. I hope that you have understood. inshallah taala in the next video we'll go further uh, with the same chapter
uh, leave your comments if you have any difficulty or any of the question allah hafiz